Hello. Today is still Saturday, August 10th, and I have an addendum to the Marley story today. I left some very important details out, not of the story itself, but at the end of the story. So after she calmed down or whatever, I was watching Men in Black, which is a very, very um, good movie, by the way. I really liked it because it was fresh and it was fun and new characters, characters and a gorgeous man and a very smart African-American young lady. And I love that movie. Not love. I, uh, I'm using the word love. Not love, but I really liked the movie. And I really liked Little. I saw Little today with Regina Hall. It was a blast. And who else was in it? Hmm can't remember the lady's name, but she played an awkward. Is, it, is Issa Rae or something like that? Anyway, um, I went off on a tangent. Just had a great day watching movies today. That wasn't my intention. I was supposed to get things done. But again, away from the tangent, back into the light, back into my Marley story. So after Marley calmed down, after she read me my rights, after she bust me out. She came back to me as I was watching the movie and she said, Auntie, will you read this book to me? And I looked at her and I said, right after the movie. And she said, Auntie, how come you don't love me no more? I was like, Marley, Auntie will always love you. Always. You can say, don't talk to me no more. You can yell at me and fuss me out. You can throw toys. I will always love you. No matter what you do, Auntie will always love you. And she looked at me with a smile and she's like, thank you, Auntie. And she allowed me to watch my movie. She got peace of mind after telling me off and knowing that I loved her unconditional, unconditionally and everything was going to be okay. We were good. So I did leave my sister's house today on good terms with my little princess, Marley. So that was a very important detail. That she went from 100 back down to zero. What's up?